Henry Ford, mechanic, inventor, industrialist. In the 1920s, he launched the United States into the era of the automobile and provided the means necessary for the mass production of goods. Ford is associated with the creation of the assembly line, an industrial innovation that let automobiles be manufactured quickly and efficiently. But Ford had a secret. Transformers! Commissioned by the government, Ford worked in his secret lab. His aim was to create a team of super crime-fighting robots. But he was not prepared for what would happen next. The Transformers split into two teams, the Autobots and the Decepticons. They would wage a war the likes of which had never been seen. The company that created the Duesenberg, Duesenberg Automobile and Motors Company, was originally founded in 1913 by Fred and August Duesenberg. There were three models of the Duesenberg cars, the Model A, the Model X, and the Model J. The Model A was advanced and highly expensive. It sold for $6,500 at the lowest. The very rare Model X to Essenberg was a longer and heavier Model A. The Model X was also much sportier than the Model A in design. The company was later taken over by a man named E.L. Cord, who wanted Fred Wessenberg to create a car that was the best in the world. After 27 months of work, Fred finally finished the Model J. In the 1920s, the bicycle was mostly just thought of as a children's toy. They were mostly used as a mock motorcycle, so kids could pretend like they were performing dangerous stunts on a motorcycle. In the 1920s, trains were the commanding method of mass transportation. Trains provided comfortable and trustworthy transportation to millions of Americans. In the 1920s, passenger rail travel reached an all-time high, with 1.2 million passengers boarding 9,000 trains every day. In the 1920s, ambulances transported sick and injured people to the hospital, as they still do today. They were used for military transport, and they had a durable four-cylinder engine. Transformers! The Model T was an affordable and reliable automobile. By 1924, they accounted for half the world's car sales. The success of the Model T gave Ford the ability to expand around the globe. In total, 15 million Model Ts were sold before its production ended in 1927. Robots in disguise Strong enough to break the bravest heart We have to pull together We can't see the worlds apart 
The airplane was never taken seriously by anyone until the federal government developed the idea of airmen. The idea of using airplanes to transport mail quickly caught on. As airmail became more popular, other industries began turning to the airplane as a form of freighting that was much faster than land-based transportation. So the airplane quickly became an integrated part of American business during the 1920s. In the 1920s, air travel captured the imaginations of Americans. The airplane could provide quick communication and commerce around the world. Airplanes were mostly just used for delivering mail, but began to be used for passenger transport as they became larger.